Hey guys, it's Arit here and in this video I'm going to show you how to upload your profile picture and your channel art. So let's start off on youtube.com and we're going to sign in. And once you've signed in, click on my channel. So if you've started a brand new channel, it'll look something like this. We're going to start off by uploading a profile picture and you do that by clicking this little pencil icon here. Now what it's going to do is it's going to take you to your Google Plus page because that's where you need to upload your profile picture in order for it to show up on your YouTube channel. And it says that right here. As soon as we clicked on that icon, it says your channel icon is linked to your Google Plus account and edits on your Google Plus account may take a few minutes to show up on your channel. So just keep that in mind. After you upload your profile picture, it won't show up right away on your channel. So come back to it later to make sure it, it's there. So we're gonna click on edit. And uh, you can see here I've, I've already uploaded um, a profile picture here that's why it's showing up but I'm going to show you how to do that so if you hover over this circle area here it's going to show a little camera and it's going to say change profile photo so when you click on that you are going to be taken to this box here where you can select a photo from your computer or you can just drag it right in there so I already have the folder here opened up with my profile picture it's this one right here and it's 800 by 800 pixels. Just make sure your uh, picture is designed in a square because it'll be much easier when you crop it and it'll, it'll, um, it'll just ensure that the full picture will show up. So I'm going to drag that in there. And you'll see what I mean. If your picture isn't a square, then you're going to have to select a certain part of the picture to show up. But, in it, but because this picture is a square, I can go right ahead and crop it like so to make sure the whole picture shows up. And then you're going to click on Set as Profile Photo. And it's going to bring up this box saying, do you want to post about your new photo, which you can. This will show up on your Google Plus page, but I'm just going to go ahead and click cancel here. And there you have it. So it's going to show up right there. So again, uh, once you go back to your channel, if you hit refresh, a few minutes later, it might not show up right away. You're going to have to wait a little bit of time. In this case, I waited um, it's about an hour later that I uploaded the profile picture and I did that earlier so you can see when I refresh it shows up right here on your channel. So next let's upload the channel art. Click on add channel art. And again same thing you you drag a photo right in or select it from your computer. I have it ready over here. and the recommended size for your channel art is 2560 pixels by 1440 pixels so when you drag that in there it's going to show up on the banner but i wanted to while that's uploading i'm just gonna note that um, your viewers will be seeing your channel quite possibly on all types of on different devices so on their phone on their tablets iPad not just your desktop so when you're designing your channel art just make sure that you have a, uh, I have a graphic here to show you just make sure that your text and your pictures are in the safe area right here so that's within the 1546 by 423 area because the areas on the sides might get, might get cut off. So if you have text on the sides, then they might be cut off when someone looks at it on a mobile phone or on their tablet. So just keep that in mind. You can use a free tool like PicMonkey to create your banner art or even your profile picture. If you're a Photoshop whiz, awesome. Otherwise, uh, you can look for a picture on Google. Uh, just make sure it's license free so you can use it 
and uh, there won't be any copyright issues with that. Sorry, my window's open and there is a plane going by right now, so that's why you might hear it on the microphone. Uh, so yeah, let's go back to the channel and it shows you a preview right here. So it shows you the desktop preview. You can see it looks good on the TV. It will be quite enlarged, so just keep that in mind and uh, it'll show you a preview of the mobile phone. Since my uh, channel art graphic is quite straightforward and there's no text or anything, this is a lot easier to use. So I'm just going to click on select. It's going to save and voila it shows up it looks awesome here it looks pretty cool um so that's how you upload your profile picture and your channel art if you have any questions please feel free to leave me a comment down below and if this video was helpful give us a like and subscribe to this channel for more awesome biz tips and social media tips every tuesday i look forward to seeing you in the next video bye